Hey guys, it's Lindsay and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be helping you with the issue Snapchat My Eyes Only feature not working. So what is Snapchat's My Eyes Only feature? It's a way to move Snapchats to a private folder so they're not stored in the memories section. So how do you use My Eyes Only? Let's go to the bottom of this screen and click the camera icon. From here, you're going to go to the left of the record button and click the two cards icon. So as you can see, this is where your memories are stored. If you go all the way to the right, that's where my eyes only is stored. And it is password protected. So if the reason it's not working is because you forgot your password, you do need to reach out to Snapchat to resolve the issue because it's very strictly password protected. So how do you move something to my eyes only? Let's go back to memories. You choose a photo, I'll choose this one. And then you click the three dots in the upper right hand corner. From here, you choose my eyes only. And then you press move and it is automatically moved to the my eyes only section. And then let's just go to my eyes only and double check. So you enter in your password. And there it is, there's the photo. Now, if you are unable to move the photo to my eyes only, there's a few things that you can do. The first thing you'll wanna do is check for an update. The reason we update our apps is because it'll get rid of any bugs or lags the last update may have had, and you not being able to use my eyes only may be a bug. So let's head to the app store. Once you're in the App Store, type Snapchat in the top search bar. So to the right of Snapchat, it'll either say Open or Update. If it says Open, your app is fully up to date. If it says Update, you are in need of an update. So go ahead and update your app. Now, if updating your app doesn't fix your problem, the next thing we're going to want to do is check your internet speed. So we're going to go to Safari and open up a Google speed test. Just type Google speed test at the top. And then you go ahead and click run speed test right here. So my internet looks like it's pretty good right now, but if yours is not, what you're going to want to do is switch to LTE. So swipe down from the upper right hand corner of your screen and turn off your Wi-Fi. The reason we switch to a cellular connection is because sometimes a cellular connection is much stronger than a Wi-Fi connection. And if you're trying to use Snapchat on a weak Wi-Fi connection, then some of its features are not going to work. Now, if updating your app and switching to LTE doesn't work, I do suggest uninstalling the app and reinstalling it through the App Store. So that means deleting the app fully off your phone and reinstalling it through the App Store. I hope one of these things helped you guys. If they did, please like and subscribe to this channel. If you have any questions about this video, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.